Nigeria's House of Representatives has opened a probe into why the inland port complexes in the east remain underutilized. At a public hearing in Abuja, practitioners and other key actors in the maritime sector attribute the non-maximization of the ports to insecurity, robbery and piracy and other vices. National Assembly correspondent Joke Adisa has more. Nigeria can boast of six sea ports. They are the Lagos Port Complex and the Tinkan Island Port, both in Lagos State, the Calabar Port in Cross River State, the Wari Port, as well as those in Onne and Port Harcourt in River State. While most of these ports have the capacity to accommodate ocean liners, only the Lagos Port Complexes operate at near full capacity for exportation and importation of goods. The task before this HADA committee is to understand why the other ports, apart from those in Lagos State, are lying almost fallow at the expense of the nation's economy. You all must be involved to help and provide solutions to what has not only become a dangerous reality of everyday life in the commercial capital city of Lagos, but has also become a national embarrassment for international visitors and users of the Lagos port complexes. It is the responsibility of this committee to deliver a policy framework and make substantive proposals for legislative and executive actions to drive the increased utilization of these ports for the socioeconomic benefit of Nigerian people. Key actors in the sector step up to outline what, in their view, are the cause of the challenges the lawmakers are seeking to resolve. Among these are lack of good road infrastructure, insecurity, armed robbery, and absence of sanctions for those who violate the laws. The droughts or debts available for clearance between the uh, keel or the bottom of the vessel and the surface of the ground underwater is very small. So that greatly impedes movement. There are deficit in major equipment that port require um, that will attract investors or people calling into uh, to the ports to utilize those ports. The committee will at the end of its six week time frame recommend ways of restoring the full use of the Wari, Patakot, One, Calaba and Onicha ports. The goal is to significantly increase government's revenue profile, enhance import and export businesses, while also reducing the undue pressure on the Papa and Tinkan port complexes in Lagos State. Jokaya Adisa, TVC News, Abuja.